name is Patrick Lynch and I'm the Biofuel Sustainability Manager and I also buy the used cooking oil that we use as a biodiesel feedstock at our plants in Immingham and Teesside and soon to be Amsterdam as well. Originally biodiesel was produced from virgin agricultural crops like soybean oil or rapeseed oil. We've decided to switch to wastes and use cooking oil specifically using that waste avoids competition for land and food and disposes of a pollutant safely and uh, sustainably. To prove that every litre of our waste biodiesel meets our technical specifications and also to prove that it really is a waste and not an agricultural vegetable oil, uh, we've, we've developed pioneering traceability systems that allow us to trace every litre of waste oil back through the supply chain to the point of origin at a restaurant. We buy from the UK and Ireland, from the United States, from China, the Middle East, the Far East and Australia. By creating demand for this used cooking oil, we encourage the suppliers and originators of used cooking oil to dispose of their waste sustainably and safely. Because we've expanded our production volumes at the plants, we've also had to explore the world and find uh, more supplies of used cooking oil that meet our physical quality specifications, but also that give us optionality on price. Our network of used cooking oil collectors will go to each restaurant and collect the, the oil in the cans or the barrels or um, direct from the plumbed-in systems. We've had long relationships with them and um, that's become a really secure supply into our biodiesel plant. Um, we can rely on those local collectors to deliver clean, uh, refined used cooking oil that meets our technical specifications to make biodiesel. Once those processors have cleaned it up to our um, technical specification, uh, which is a very low water content and, and impurity content, they will then deliver that to our biodiesel plant in trucks or ISO tanks um, and even in ships. Our biodiesel is blended into road diesel up to 7% and is used in buses and cars that are unmodified and on the road today, helping to reduce carbon emissions. Mm -hmm.